Celebrity Insider. Counting on star Jeremy Vuolo recently announced via an Instagram post that he would be enrolling in the Master's Seminary to pursue a degree in pastoral ministry when he shared his acceptance letter from Pastor John MacArthur. But, his decision to attend the school has come with a bit of controversy. According to a Reddit user, there have been accusations that MacArthur covered up a rape that took place on campus back in 2006. When Vuolo made the announcement, he couldn't help but gush about the honor. I am so grateful to the Lord, as well as to Pastor John MacArthur and, Reverend Austin T. Duncan, for giving me the incredible opportunity to begin theological and pastoral studies at that master seminary," he wrote. But, according to In Touch, a former student, who goes by Jane, wrote an open letter about her sexual assault at the school, and revealed that MacArthur and Pastor Rick Holland threatened to kick her out of school and thought she needed discipline for drinking, doing drugs, and almost dancing. She also says that they forced her to apologize to the attacker that raped and drugged her. Jane says that she knows she is a rape victim, but when she went to the police, they stuck her in a room, did a good cop, bad cop routine, and then accused her of lying. She says that is not how you treat a rape victim, and she is now studying to become a rape counselor and knows that the cops did the opposite of what they should have. She also wrote that when she returned to campus and told her resident director about what happened, they told her that she broke the rules of her signed contract that promised no drugs or drinking. Jane says that Holland was angry at her for going to the police and the doctor, and she should have instead allowed the church to handle the situation without outside interference. He then told her not to tell anyone else, including her classmates, teachers, or anyone in the church. Later, Holland accused Jane of ruining the young man's life. She says her attacker eventually confessed to his sin, but they still asked her to apologize for the dress she wore at the bar. Holland said that Jane caused the young man to stumble and was angry because she didn't drop the charges. They eventually kicked Jane out of school, and the pastors told her that if she showed up on campus, the police would arrest her. She claims that the school changed her three years of college credits from A's to F's which resulted in her flunking out. She also reveals that only person from the community believes her, but she can't move on until she brings this darkness to light. After Jane's blog post, the Master's Seminary released a statement denying her accusations, and wrote that their internal inquiry and review of the situation has led them to the belief that the blog post is plainly incorrect. They also said that there are various inaccuracies in Jane's narrative, and the male she accused was never a student at the Master's University of Seminary. It isn't clear if Jeremy Vuolo is aware of the allegations against his new school, but fans believe he should think twice about his decision to attend the institution. New episodes of Counting on Return to TLC later this summer.